Hi! Today, I want to give some tips on how to handle cyber bullying. Number one is to know that you are being cyber bullied. If you tak sedar apa yang terjadi dalam uh, satu situasi tu, you don't, you're not aware of what someone is doing to you, then you may not be able to respond to it efficiently or effectively. Faham tak maksud saya? Kalau kita tak tahu apa orang buat kat kita, macam mana kita nak tahu cara terbaik untuk bertindak? Okay, so always know your situation. Are you being cyber bullied or not? So once you dah peka dengan benda tu, second is to know that uh, bullies only do it because they feel empowered when you feel affected by it what i because I, I i think in my position i get cyber bullied every single day sexually people send me messages that as a married woman and as a woman in general i shouldn't be receiving these kind of messages because it's just rude okay but i can't control what other people are sending to me every day there are hundreds and I can show it to you one day on my YouTube channel if I feel like I want to do this topic again. So, you have to know that when you react to this bullying, especially when you react in a way that lets them know that it affects you, it, it makes you sad, it makes you depressed, it makes you angry, these are the reactions that empower them. Orang yang cakap ni, dia memang nak kita marah, nak kita rasa malu, nak kita rasa jijik. Don't. That's not who you are. It's just words that people use. Uh, I guess it's it's an opinion of what they think you are. And why why does their opinion matter? Sometimes it's not just an opinion. It's just... It's just... Kosong. You know, and they have nothing better to say. They don't know anything better to do. They don't have anything else that can make themselves feel better or, you know, just so many reasons why people are mean and become cyber bullies on social media. And there are also people who are cyber, cyber bullies. They bully people, but they don't even know that you're a cyber bully. Do you, are you a cyber bully? Why don't you check? Okay. So... We can't in three kilometers. People. Take the exit on the left. Like they, they, they thrive. They're waiting for someone or something, and, and they just want to trample and say mean things and make you feel like you want to commit suicide, and that's what they want. Okay. So number three, you need to learn not to care. You need to learn not to care. It's either you you ignore it and. You show to them that, what are you saying? I don't get it. What? Okay, all right. Mm -hmm. And not be affected by it. Or stand tall, loud, call them out. Either way, you know. You can be empowered knowing that whatever people say, I know the truth. I'm not like that. That's what you think of me or what you want me to believe. But that's not who I am. This is who I am. You take that power back and just make sure you understand who you are for yourself or you call them out hello i ain't like that nice try though have a good day bye ciao and maybe a middle finger that's fine so that's basically it with what i with what i deal with if people are overly mean i block them if they think they can have power over me i may call them out um, however way you choose to handle it is your choice but don't allow other people's opinion um, and perception and, and, and whatever on you and you believe it please don't that's the only main thing don't believe it don't be don't be affected by it I know it takes time it actually takes a bit of time to get used to it but takes practice 